Big news coming in. Vinesh Pogat storms into the semi-finals. Face of wrestlers' protest shines at the Olympics. Vinesh Pogat pulls off the dangal style win. Well, we're looking at Vinesh Pogat inching closer to a medal, uh, making us so proud. The face of the wrestlers' agitation, the protest in India. Vinesh Pogat is inching closer to a medal. She's stormed into the semis. A big good news coming in for India from the Olympics. Vinesh Pogat who wins over reigning gold medalist Yui Susaki. Uh, she, at this point, is has stepped into the semis, making it uh, one step closer for her to win a medal for India. Let me quickly cut across to Nikhil Naz for him to elaborate on this. Nikhil, please go on. How? Uh, what are the chances for Vinesh Pogat to bring a medal home? Well, I, I'd say that she's now the odds-on favorite to uh, bring a medal back. Because uh, the toughest opponent that she would have had uh, in this draw, she came up against her in the very first round. And that was primarily down to the fact that uh, Vinish was unseated in this tournament. Uh, uh, many might say that, listen, she's one of the top wrestlers in the world, and why is it that she was unseated? She changed her weight category for these games. She has been fighting in the 63 kilogram category, but there was a bit of a dispute with the wrestling federation. Uh, she was asked to go through a trial, which eventually weren't conducted. There's another Indian wrestler competing uh, in that weight category in Antim. Uh, so she tried to avoid that controversy, ensured that uh, you know she can uh, reach the Paris Games, and took a major gamble by dropping down about uh, uh, 10 kilos of her body weight to compete in the 50 kilogram category, and which is why, because she hadn't participated in that weight category for a long time, she was unseated, and that is why. She came up against uh, uh, opposition in Susaki in the first round. But uh, once she's gone past that hurdle, uh, you would have to say that she's now a favourite to uh, not only win a medal, but uh, dare I say that she'd even be the favourite to be considered for a gold medal match. She has won her quarter final with uh, Consumit E. Uh, up next, uh, she will be participating in her semi final that she had to win. Uh, luckily for her, the two tough games have gone by back to back really quickly. You know, uh, uh, wrestling two bouts uh, that, that she's fought. Two rounds beat, so four rounds in all can rarely be tiring for a wrestler. But the good thing for her is now you, you've got a bit of a gap. So it's about a three-hour gap that she'll have uh, between her quarterfinal and the semifinal. So she can uh, relax, rejuvenate, and then come back stronger for the semifinal. And then uh, it's that just one one last battle. If she is to win that semifinal, then she's guaranteed a gold or a silver, though she'll be gunning. Gold, uh, looking at the way that she's performing here uh, in this tournament. But yeah, great news. Uh, we've, we've seen a few disappointments in the last few days. Uh, players reaching very close to a medal, but then missing out at the at the last moment. Uh, Vinish is looking good. Uh, so, being a few cross because we, we had a similar scenario with Lakshya Sen yesterday, if you remember. Yeah, yeah. So looking good for a bronze medal, but then uh, started off well, but then missed out. So, uh, uh, we'll have to wait and watch that one hurdle. If she's win that next game, which as I said is in three hours from now, uh, then then it is, it is the time to celebrate at least the medal. And then uh, 12 o'clock Indian Standard Time, almost around midnight, she'll be if she does win that, she'll be fighting for the gold medal. In that scenario, if she was to uh, lose that semi-final, she still won't be out of medal contention. Uh, we'll still fight for the bronze medal match. That's also Great. around 11:30 p.m. Indian Standard Time. But at the moment, as I said. Uh, the way she's been fighting, you have to say that, that she should be fighting for good. Yeah, we're looking at visuals of her family members cheering back home. It's been a difficult journey for Vinesh Pogat. She was a face of the wrestler's agitation. Um, you know, it was a sexual assault case against uh, a sitting in MP at that point. And the, you know, at the struggles that we saw of these wrestlers while they were protesting, you know, it's, it's really... Um, motivating to see that she's made it to the Olympics yet again when there were that many people who wanted to write her off. Nikhil, if you're with me. Well, that's right. Uh, you know, just taking back uh, uh, to those protests that started in the January of 2023, uh, remember, uh, she took a stand, in fact, stood up for a lot of other wrestlers where she said that, you know, uh, there has been uh, 
uh, a lot of issues uh, uh, pertaining to female wrestlers, young wrestlers at that. And she decided to put her foot down and stand up in those agitation. At that time, she received a lot of flag, a lot of criticism, Nabila, simply because on two counts. One, uh, they thought that the protest had gone too far. There was a there was a uh, section that that thought the protest had gone too far because the ministry had been trying to take steps and they they asked the wrestlers that you know give us some time. But but uh, she was uh, you know really determined to continue, saying no, we're not going to step down. So what that was costing her was valuable practice time. Remember, they were they were on the streets, they were missing out on the important practice sessions, they missed out on a few major international competitions which were needed to win paper for the Olympic Games. So it wasn't really the ideal preparation that a wrestler would have liked. But then, you know, on the contrary, maybe that that has really fueled the fire within her. So at the moment, you you when you see her on the mat, as I was I just saw her uh, fight that bout. When you see her on the mat, it's, I mean, I, I've seen her for the last decade or so. This, of course, is third Olympic Games. But, but you do see a different Manish for One, that's, of course, running for a medal for our country. But the other, that's, that's also proving a point to the public at large. Uh, and, and all the detractors yeah. that, that did criticize her, saying that, you know, you're wasting valuable time. Uh, saying that, listen, that was something that needed to be done. And at no point did I compromise on my preparation. Yeah. And that's right. if anything, that's probably fueled her fire because she wants to say uh, that, that the system wasn't really kind to her mm. and yet she is going to be delivering at the stage of the